Good afternoon. I'm Peter Abraham with Tiffin, and this is the Steadicam Scout, an elegant precision machine. The Steadicam is designed to hold cameras with a net camera capacity from 5 to 18 pounds, a tremendous range. Everything from ENG cameras with full accessories down to a smaller, lighter video camera with very few accessories besides the battery required to run it. The heart of every Steadicam is a precision designed and built three axis gimbal and the Steadicam arm. The combination of the two elements allows the Steadicam to be operated and isolate all of the operator's movement from the camera, delivering a perfectly stable platform. The top of the Steadicam Scout is called the Stage. It features tools free adjustment knobs for front to back, which allow you to control the balance front to back, and side to side, which allow us to set the Steadicam so that it's sitting perfectly flat and in line with the horizon. The top stage comes with a BNC connector to run to the standard definition monitor and a 12 volt power out. The Scout comes with a cable that plugs in here, which terminates at a standard 4 pin XLR for larger cameras like ENG. The vest can be fitted to people of any size and shape. Easy adjustments, Velcro straps and some metal buckles. It fits very quickly. The Steadicam arm has a boom range of 32 inches and features tool-free lift adjustment. That is to say, if I wanted this arm to work harder because the camera weighed more, I could simply turn these knobs and the arm would be pushing harder. Or if I had a much lighter camera or wanted the camera to float much closer to the ground, I could do what's called detuning the arm and relax the amount of lift being delivered, and the Steadicam operates just as well with it hanging lower to the ground. That TFT monitor has an anti-reflective film bonded to the face of it. It's great outside on bright sunny days. The light strikes the film and spreads to the edges. Gives it a lot more punch. All of our Steadicams have center posts that can telescope out. By telescoping out and then adjusting the gimbal quickly with a tool, I can raise or lower the lens height drastically. To move the camera back to a normal operating distance, you simply use the tool's free lock and telescope the post back. Now the Scout is set up in what's called low mode. As you can see, the camera's been inverted and is working much closer to the ground. The monitor is up here closer to my eye. Using a small device called an F bracket, we invert the angle of the handle, allowing us to get even lower to the ground. This is lower than your average toddler who learns to walk, and yet the Steadicam moves with the same fluid motion. and we still have that 32 inch boom range. This is what's called low mode. As is the case with every genuine TIFF and Steadicam, you can run down the street with it, or you can execute incredibly gentle slow moves, all with the same precision and the same results, just like the bigger systems. If you have any questions about the Steadicam Scout, or any TIFF and Steadicam, contact Full Compass, or check them out at fullcompass.com.